Okay, we're looking at the Petzl Lynx Crampon. Ice climbing, uh, mixed climbing as well. Probably more or less for ice climbing, but I've used it for just general mountaineering and I haven't had any issues nor complaints. But it also does have a lot to do with the footwear that I have. These are great. These are really good. Before this I had the, I think it was the Petzl Vasak. So these links have the adjustable toes on them that uh, for really gripping into the ice. They can actually be moved up or down, sideways. You can take one off and just put the one on there. I keep it with just the dual and it works just fine. It has a lot of feature, or a, a lot of gripping on here. It even has an additional like claw here in the middle in between. Uh, very, very sharp when they come out of the box and to keep them sharp, remember, only use them in the ice or snow. Don't walk in the dirt or, or uh, for some people, pavement with them. They're step-in compatible, which is great because they fit on my boot. So what I went ahead and did was, put it on my boot to give you an example of what it looks like here and it also comes with this little this little bag a crampon bag usually got to buy it uh, for dependability for, for correction for purpose for general purpose I'm gonna give this I'm gonna give this a four because it has so many grips on here for what I'm trying to do with it now granted I should probably have a different set for general mountaineering but uh, it's almost too grippy and uh, when it comes to uh, climbing vertical vertical ice, which I haven't necessarily done per se, but I've gotten kind of close to it. It was just really steep. It works great, but if you're not on vertical ice, probably better to use a different crampon. So uh, for its general purpose as being a crampon, it's going to get a four. And then for its comfort, I don't have, I, I can't even really feel it when it's on my boot at all. Of course, that comes with uh, experience in, in tightening and properly positioning it on there and, and most people actually end up putting it wrong. It's supposed to be on the correct foot as well. But they are stepping compatible, which is nice, and they come on and off very quickly. So right now, I have it on the boot, and I have it on the step-in mode, but it also comes with the toe cover in case you need, you don't have stepping compatible crampons. You can just put a regular boot in there that's not stepping compatible, and it will still hold it. Uh, so for comfort, I'm going to give it a four because, you know, I, it does fit on the boot nicely, I just kind of wish that uh, this back clip right here uh, didn't pull so tight all the time. I have to constantly adjust it on the back. Well, maybe not constantly, but at least once every couple uses. It's almost like either uh, just with the play it's, it's being moved or um, maybe I'm just having a, an adjustment issue up here. But it happens on both boots. So, And then dependability, five. Awesome. I mean, especially with the price given that I picked this up with that little pouch because it all comes together, about $245. It's a little steep, but for if you're doing some uh, vertical ice climbing, it works really well. Not too recommended for a mountaineering, even though I do use it for that. And I don't have any complaints. It's still a great crampon. Still better than the uh, the Vasak that I had before. So I uh, just got to get a little bit more experience with when it comes to uh, using different other types of crampons. But this is definitely the best crampon that I've used. So. Highly recommended. It's a little steep on the price, but again, when it comes to Petzl, you do get what you pay for.